Hey, what's up, guys? This is Justin from Justice League Swag, and today we're going to be doing a deck profile on uh, Dark Heroes. This is one of our uh, local players, uh, Mike, who plays uh, Dark Heroes and, like, everything, like Shadow Shades. I think he made top eight with Shadow Shades at uh, Atlanta Regionals for Worlds this year. So, congrats, Mike. Thank you, thank you. So next we're going to kick it off, uh, the Buddy of Scar. So like flag. Say, Buddy of Scar. That basic flag, though. Yeah, I know, I know. But, hey, it's Hero World. Yeah. So we run uh, Fifth Omni Mukuro, run him okay. at four. So uh, could you spread it, just spread it out? Okay, yeah. So four Mukuro. Four Mukuro. Running two Shadow Hero Schwartz. Okay, shorts for center removal to get that rush in there. Got a got a rush. Running four. Dark Fist Gwen for those shadow dive for those nice wall decks. Okay, yeah, so you can shadow dive and then ideally impact for game once you get there. Shadow dive with three impact for game. Yep. And of course, running four of the buddy, the scar. Yep. Open center rush. Makes sense. We have one uh, Schwartz for, for some for item hate. Yeah. Whitey is really good. Especially for mirror matches, then probably side more. Schwartz SD. Get you some gauge. Yep. Just pitch one. Yep. And Schwartz as he works very well with this card. You pitch him. You can either control. You can either get more gauge on your hand or uh, get or reduce the gauge of your, of your opponent. Could you slide it to the left more? Yeah. All right. Cool. So, uh, what is that? Three noble knight. Yep. Kill knight. Oh no, kill knight. Kill knight. Yep, three kill knight. Yeah. Noble of dark darkness. Kill knight. Okay. That was cool. I missed that deck. <laughs> All so, right. Now we're going to go to impacts. I actually run, of course, four Infinity Death Crest. Okay. You know, yeah, it's pretty straightforward. Four damage if your opponent's at four or less. It's like classic kill card. And then I also run two... Um, Schwartz Cubo 13. Okay, That's cool. Pitch him, destroy no, all the monsters, the monsters on the field. You're at six. Nice. There's also a, a common card that just came out of that set, too. Well, you could call a card from your hand without paying this cost. You could actually call the impact monster from your hand and blow your opponent's field while they're attacking. I think that's just pretty cool to note. But that sounds like something I would do. Like, I'm, I'm all for the douchebaggery. <laughs> so then, going to spells, run... Three damage control. Yeah. Pitch to reduce damage. Because since a lot of cards bounce back to your hand, you have an open center yourself. Yep. And you have fodder to discard. <laughs> yep. To keep you alive for those extra turns. Run two hyper energy. Nice. Who, who doesn't like four gauge? Yeah. That's good considering all the impacts that you run. And then Mokuro scale himself. Yep. Run three dark hero hideout. When a dark hero enters your field, you draw draw a card. Okay. Run two. About time to get serious. Yeah. All classic. Yeah, six or less life draw to you. Just love to just you know little little spell hate. Oh uh, yeah, that is vicious. <laughs> Especially when you're swinging with a three crit monster and your opponent tries to negate. Or you link a link attack cheese and negate a spell and then impact. It's pretty good. Then we have two. I'm finished with you. Okay, just to like clear off a of Gwen in case it didn't hit or the search through your deck. Makes sense. Makes sense. Then two, but he's at the lowest rank. Okay, so if something's destroyed, then you get the search for uh, for a weapon. Yeah. Of course, we have to have 
four. I see through, through your moves. moves. Yeah, staple negate for our hero world. And then two evil aesthetics. Yeah, to get back that Mukuro if your opponent popped it, or and another monster. Like that's the like best step. Or if they didn't pop uh, Mukuro, get back two scar or whatever you need to just finish your opponent that turn. You could also get back the impact monster off of that. And then finally. Three sneak judgment. Okay. Just to assure that you always have an item on top of like running Mukuro. Exactly. Plus, okay. Plus, when the, uh, the card leaves your field, you draw. Okay. So, more draw power too. Okay. So, set yourself up uh, with draw power. So, uh, thanks for the uh, deck profile, Mike. And hopefully, we'll be seeing more videos with Definitely. you.